Hey guys, Max from MHS Cloud here and today I want to show you something really really cool. This is a small material with an OSL node made by Silverwing and it's really amazing because it allows you to uh, have a different texture projection on instances and that's really really great. You can see how it works by opening the node editor you have uh, like this um, OSL texture projection and it can uh, just project uh, any kind of uh, image texture on your, your instance and that's really cool because it's something uh, hard to do when you want to have different texture projection with instance and actually uh, Raphael made it uh, for the community so I want to give him a big hug and you can uh, check out his post in the Octane Render group you can uh, put uh, J'adore on his post and nothing by myself or anything just I want to make this video to spread a bit uh, what it does for the community because I think that's uh, really incredible to have a great artist like him sharing resources and stuff and for free I mean it's really great so I will uh, copy paste this inside the description and just check his website, uh, give him some love, follow him, follow him on Instagram and uh, everything. And you can find an, on this website and under free stuff, really uh, cool things you can find. Uh, yeah, it's a bit old, but he made an Uber ch shader and he made some things that was uh, helpful to me back in the time you can check his work and also great great uh, tips also on tray planar ma mapping and a few other tips that can be really uh, helpful so it's really easy to, to do just you can uh, download uh, the material and when you when you have it I recommend you to go in uh, your content browser you need to go under file and you can create a new preset library as you can see I've created a new preset library called Octane and you will get uh, the material right there and you can also have the, the material if you get the C4D project and you just uh, need to go uh, there and just drag and drop your material. It's really simple and every time uh, you will open your C4D, uh, every new time, every new project, you will be able to go on Content Browser Presets and find this nice material and apply it on every of your mesh with instance. So it will work only if you are uh, in uh, instance, uh, render instance mode. Uh, so you can see uh, here I have my uh, different cubes and just to, to avoid the, um, some mistakes. Yeah, you see a lot of cubes. I can launch Octane, wait a bit. wait a long time oh, I, actually it was already open that's my fault sorry guys um, so if I drop it you will see that each material has the same projection it's because it's made to work with render instances and now you can see that it changed and the difference because between instance and render instance is that render instance uh, takes by far less memories and it's really important to optimize your scene uh, with Octane and uh, thank you guys for watching this small video it was uh, really small all the credits goes to Rafael Ro Silverwing check out his website and if you are new to the community feel free to check out our Facebook group called Motion Designers Community we have a, a Discord as well and we are making uh, great stuff, sharing great stuff you can also join the Octane Render 
uh, Discord, a lot of uh, nice people uh, and stuff, and also you can join the, the Optine Render group. It's an amazing group uh, to share your work and uh, find inspiration, meet new people. Uh, actually, Optane has, has a, a really, really good community. Thank you for watching this small video and uh, goodbye.